Hello there, everybody, and I think you know my name already. My name is Migro, and this time we're going to talk about food. Salmon, to be more precise. And our title here is actually a question. Super Salmon? Okay, I think we need to answer that question later. For now, let's check out the chart. Oh, I wonder why it's called a Super Salmon. Genetic material from two other fish is added to the Atlantic salmon. Okay, so this is the base, Atlantic salmon. And I guess it's going to get something from the Chinook salmon and the ocean pout. But why is it called the super salmon? If they, if they mix all of these genes together, why is it called a super salmon? The GMO salmon grow faster. Hmm. Hey guys, what do you mean when you say GMO? Well, we can find the answer here. <laughs> GMO. Aqua Advantage salmon are fully grown at 18 months. Hmm. The standard Atlantic salmon at the same age. Well, it's really small. And the meaning of GMO is genetically modified. Okay, so scientists made the fish, well, super. But I think we now know why it's super. Because it's a lot bigger than the regular salmon. Hmm. But let's find out more. Let's read. Okay. A fish, the first genetically al altered animal is approved for eating. Okay. A super salmon that has never been seen in nature just got closer to store shelves and restaurant menus. Aqua Advantage is Atlantic salmon that has been changed by the addition of genetic material from two other fish species. And what are those fish, uh, fish species? Well, it's right here. It's probably the Chinook salmon and the ocean pout. Hmm. The modified salmon grows twice as a regular salmon. Okay, I think we were right about that. We answered that question a while ago. Last November, the U.S. Food and Drug Administration approved Aqua Advantage salmon for consumption. Hmm. The fish will be raised in tanks in Canada and Panama, says Aqua Bounty, its developer. Is it okay to eat? Or is it safe, I mean, to eat? Well, that's a question that we need to think about first. Hmm. Anyways, we still have a few words to talk about here. We have four, actually. And the first one is nature. I think everybody knows what that means. Nature is everything around you. The trees, the animals, everything. And can you guys give me a sentence with that word? Nature. Oh, that was pretty good. All righty, all righty. That is nature. Let's talk about stores. What are stores again in a complete sentence? <laughs> stores are places where we can buy things. Okay, so where do you guys go shopping? In a really big store. It's, but it's actually called a mall. <laughs> So that store. Oh, I think we talked about this already. Salmon. It's a fish that we eat. And I want you guys to use your dictionary for our second word. Oh, I mean, not our second word, for our fourth word. Consumption. Any ideas? Okay. Let me give you guys the meaning one second. For the word consumption. Let me just capitalize that. Consumption. Check out your chat window, please. The process of taking food into the body through the mouth. Hmm. Okie dokie, but here's a question that we need to think about. Are genetically modified food? It's really safe to eat? Are they really safe to eat? Are there 
products that are genetically modified already in the market. Hmm. Is it really safe? That's my main point. Well, I guess we have to do our research there, because for now, I gotta go. See you next time. Bye-bye.